Good afternoon. I apparently really needed my sleep last night after all yesterday's work, grandparents' house and whatnot. It's three o'clock, and let me just say I haven't been up for very long. But we have a breathtaking day today. Even so, that's an understatement. It's a perfect 73, 74 out here, and look at this. That is all green now. Bright, brilliant blue skies with some uh, some serious clouds off there to the east, but it's, it's beautiful. So I think today is going to be productive, as I mentioned yesterday. And I'm going to come out here, try to get these leaves done. Um, again, left side of the door over to the pine tree there. I don't do much on the side. The wind usually doesn't blow them in there, so that's good. After that, the sunroom really needs to have the screens put in so we can sit out there, open it up. It's just like you're sitting outside, but nice furniture and carpet and fan and speakers and whatnot, so we're going to do that, and grandmother's coming over for dinner tonight, my mom's mom, um, I don't know if we're going to eat outside or maybe in the sunroom or something like that, but it should be a pretty good day, welcome. Um, 20 of 8, feels like it's about noon since I got up so late, but all of the landscaping is done. In the front, I notice there's a tiny bit in the back that'll take me like 15 minutes that I'll probably do later. But all of this got done. The hardest part was probably here and behind the house, and then these two bushes here are really prickly, so that kind of sucked a little bit. But I took out another two, two and a half bags from there. But she's done. Um, I may end up spending more time in here with gloves, kind of fluffing the mulch up a little bit. It's so packed down and faded it'll look a lot nicer if I go through and fluff it up, so that might get done later. But after that, I worked on the screens. As I said, I wanted to. I got all of the windows cleaned inside and out, the whole back of the house, and then I put all the screens in, in the whole back of the house. And I got just figured out how to get out. I got that one. We don't put one in the garage, but all of those windows are now clean. And the skylights. Got up there and did the skylights in that window back there. It's a bathroom window. Yeah, she's done. And there's a Tesla. I hate when I bring the remote into the kitchen and then look for it in the family room for like five minutes. Anyhow, I'm back now. Ken and I went out. It's a beautiful night, so we went out, got some pictures of the car in front of the country club there. But I am now switching the TV over to the Apple TV input where I'm going to watch Breaking Bad before digging into my emails and YouTube because that's boring and this is more fun. So I'll show you about a little bit about how this process goes down. We go up here, we select AirPlay Apple TV and we get to wait. There it is. We'll hit play, full screen. Shaboom, shaboom, shaboom. Alright, talk to you later. So, Breaking Bad was good. That was episode 6, season 5. Um, yeah, we got that done. And then I got on the phone with Colt, did my emails for the day, got the inbox down to one that is pending on something to ship. Leave it in there for the tracking number. Uh, then I came out here and did a little bit of work with these two products. Maybe they look familiar to you. Zeno Z9 and Z10, leather soft, leather in a bottle. Got inside, got the whole front cabin area done. Both front seats, the center console, transmission tunnel, armrest, driver and passenger doors. And my God, does it smell good in there. Oh, I love that smell. When people get in my car, you know, people that, that don't ride in it all the time, they always say, oh, it smells so good in here. And I guess I've gotten used to it, but it's, it's that smell of leather, which is not only the, the Zeno product material in the bottle itself, but it rejuvenates the leather and it just brings back that almost a new car smell and it lasts quite a while. It's, it's only overpowering when you get in and you think, oh wow, this must have just been conditioned for a week maybe. But after that, it's just constant new leather smell and it's great. So tomorrow, I think I may do a video. I don't have classes tomorrow, exams Tuesday through Thursday, I only have to be there for maybe an hour each day and then I am done. But uh, tomorrow I'd like to do an E39 source video. I think somebody requested it about uh, how to do it. And I'm probably not doing it in the best way possible, but it's going to be one of those videos. This is how I put Zeno leather products on my seats. Do it how you wish. This is how I do it. 
I'm not going to be, this is how you do it, this is how I do it. So I'll be sure to make that clear. But uh, I have the entire back seat to do both rear doors and everything in the back that's leather on the console and stuff in the back of the front seats. But I did get most of the front, pretty much all of the front done today, headrests and everything. So yeah, very productive day. I got the patio furniture out. I don't think I filmed that, all the screens and the windows and the leaves in the front. So uh, definitely a good day, but I'm not even tired. It's 3.47 in the morning. It's almost four o'clock. That sucks, because then tomorrow I'm gonna sleep forever. The cat wants food. But I'm gonna try to get out tomorrow by afternoon and see what we can get done. Probably the leather in the car and I don't know what else around the house. But that's gonna be it for today. Thanks guys for watching. I'll talk to you tomorrow on Sun Monday. Good night.